Hello and welcome into the Piles of Paragraphs creative space. I'm Lori and today I am going to work on the Marguerite Miller Collage Challenge for week 38. So I'll say hello to everyone. Hope you're all doing well and you've had a chance to do something creative today. Okay, let's see. Let's get going with this. Let's see what we've got. Okay, I've got my base page here already with something on it so I don't start with that intimidating blank piece of paper. So, okay, so something found in a kitchen. So I have three choices of things for the kitchen. I have, uh, let's see, a cupcake pan, a pitcher, or a rolling pin. Um, let's see, a color that reminds you of summer, which this green and the green of this washi tape, I'm going to go with that. As you know, summer's kind of a hard thing here in the desert, but there is some green. Um, book page, a little book page, whoops. Something with holes. We have this strip from here that has holes in it. Um, let's see, musical instrument. I have a violin. And then bonus, any kind of a tag. So I have a price tag. I have a manila tag. I have a green tag. And I have a tag from um, a tea bag tea bag tag. Oh, there we go. Blech. I don't think my mouth's quite up to that today, but anyway, lots of choices, lots of choices. Let's get going and see what I can come up with. Okay, let's see if I can flatten this out a little bit. I have it under my mat, but I guess it still wants to curl up. Okay, so we have choices for something found in the kitchen. Probably. Let's get going with the book page. I don't think I want to use the whole book page. Hmm. But it does say a book page, so I guess I will use the whole book page. Okay. So let's put that up there. Okay, the color that reminds me of summer. I'm going to use the washi tape, so I'll put that on last. Let's get our musical instrument in here. The violin here. So let's see things from the kitchen. Let's see something with holes. So I have this. I just don't know how much of this I want to use. Let's see. Just let me tear off a piece of that. Mm, goodness. This is definitely going to challenge me. I've really struggled with these items because I couldn't come up with anything that actually makes them kind of go together. So that's the, that's the struggle I am having. So let's see. Well, let's go ahead and glue the book page down because I think I'm, I'm going to go with the with the literal, since it says a book page. Let's see, do I have a smaller book up here anywhere? This one is smaller, but I haven't really taken 
get any pages out of it, I don't think. So let's see. <laughs> this is a cute little, cute, cute, cute little book, but uh, obviously somebody did some scribbling in it. So let's see. Get this out. I love tiny books. I do, I do love them. Um, so let's see. So now since I have my much smaller book page. a point in time when I thought I would sit down and attempt to erase the pencil marks off these little pages but I don't uh, I don't think that's ever going to happen time time is not my friend everything takes me longer than I think it's going to so So I think I'll glue it down to keep me from hemming and hawing about where I'm going to start things. Down there. Kind of weird, but I kind of like it, so let's go with that. Let's see if I can not tear the the handles off of the rolling pin as I put my glue on it. Okay. I think I'll go ahead and glue the picture down as well. stack here in the corner, aren't we? tear the bottom of this off as well. You know how I how I love a torn edge. Oh. 
see if I can tear this without tearing into my holes. I really did want to find a, um, a cheese grater for this so the holes became part of the kitchen implement, but I, I was not successful in the amount of time I had to search, so. So that did, that did not happen. Okay. Oh, so let's see, so I have tags. That I think it's just a little too big. I do love the price tag idea. Put that up at the top. I also love this little tag. washi tape. So let's see. I do just a little piece of washi. It's not sticky. There we go. Oopsie. Gluing my, gluing my arm down. That's not going to be helpful. Okay. A little piece of washi tape here. To hold that string in place and then let's see do I want to do I want to glue that down I think I probably do as much as I like the idea of it moving around I think that over time that will just lead to it getting torn off probably since I still haven't uh, formulated the the exact plan for the final book with all these pages in them, all my collage pages in them. Let's see. Oopsie. Oopsie doodle. Knock everything down. Let me put under there. Over here. Either have too much or not enough. Get the stick. Where's my? Let's try that. There we go. And let's see. So I have one piece of washi tape. Let's do. of threes here on this uh, on this washi tape. Stick that there. And then let's see. Put a little piece up here. Kind of hide that. Too many corners thing going on there. Okay, well, let's see. Okay, let me put my pin back in my glue. My glue stick over here. Alrighty. Put those away for later. Clean up my little bits here. Okay, so something found in the kitchen. So I have three some things found in the kitchen since I couldn't make up my mind. So I have a muffin tin, a rolling pin, and a pitcher. Um, it's a color that reminds me of summer, which is the shades of green. Um, a book page. So here's a page out of a little book. Something with holes. We have holes here. 
musical instrument. We have a violin here and then any kind of a tag. So I have the uh, price tag and the tag from a tea bag. So there we go. There is Margaret Miller's collage challenge for week 38. Wow, time is just marching right along. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed this. If you did, please um, like, subscribe, and I really would appreciate a comment. Um, let's see, what would your favorite kitchen, uh, something found in the kitchen, what would your favorite thing be? Um, of course, much more wide ranging than I went for um, things you use in the kitchen, but it could be any number of things. Um, and so if you would answer that comment for me, answer that for me in the comments below. Wow, no not talking well today. I would really appreciate the comment. Um, so um, like if you like the video, subscribe if you haven't, comment if you would please. And I thank you for joining me today. I hope you'll join me again in the future. And so for now I will say bye bye.